Hello everyone, today we shall learn about reaction of metallic oxides with acids and also reaction of non-metallic oxides with bases. Now, what if we add acid to metal oxide? We take a small amount of copper oxide in a beaker and add dilute hydrochloric acid slowly while stirring. We see the color of solution would turn blue-green and this is because of formation of copper chloride. So we see an acid produces salt and water in reaction with a metal oxide. Since this reaction is similar to the reaction between an acid and a base leading to formation of salt and water, we can say metallic oxides are basic in nature. On the other hand, a base produces salt and water in reaction with non-metallic oxides. Remember, when we passed carbon dioxide through lime water, that is calcium hydroxide solution, we got white precipitate of calcium carbonate. This is represented by the chemical equation CO2 plus CaOH whole 2 gives CaCO3 plus H2O. So, a non-metallic oxide reacted with a base to produce salt and water. Since this reaction is similar to the reaction between an acid and a base leading to formation of salt and water, we can easily say non-metallic oxides are acidic in nature. So to sum up what we learnt about acid and bases today, when a metal oxide reacts with an acid, salt and water is formed. So metal oxide plus acid gives salt and water. Hence we say metallic oxides are basic in nature. Lastly, when a non-metallic oxide reacts with the base, salt and water is formed. That is, non-metal oxide plus base gives salt and water. Hence we say non-metallic oxides are acidic in nature. That's all for now. Bye-bye.